As more details emerge and video too from the assassination attempt against Trump, experts say they're getting a clearer picture of a handful of apparent lapses in security, both in preparation and the response from counter snipers who ultimately shot and killed the 20 year old gunman identified as Thomas Crooks. Among those experts are Justin Governale and Luke Hamilton, San Antonian Marine Corps veteran scout snipers who, in addition to combat tours overseas, have experience securing dignitaries around the world. Beyond security plans not including the location of the would-be assassin, they both say another major issue was actions taken by the counter snipers moments before shots rang out. One sniper took his eye off the scope, allowing the gunman to take several shots at the former president. Those rounds ultimately killed Corey Comprator, the man who died shielding his family from the gunfire. They, they preach it so much so that you can, in theory, fall asleep into that position, open your eyes and still be on target, right? So it doesn't make any sense to be about to engage someone that is has a rifle within 150 yards of a potential you know, future president of the United States and to go, in no way or meant like if that was my student, right, you just made a lethal or fatal mistake. You're you know? fired. Yeah, you're fired. The Secretary of Homeland Security, Alejandro Mayorkas, agreed today that event security was a failure and officials are conducting an independent review of the situation.